Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate Pipedrive with Gmail. First of all, we want to create ourselves an account at pipedrive.com and we want to head straight to our workspace. Once we are here, we want to go to the top right corner of workspace and uh, as you can see there's MK initials but there will be yours initials or your avatar and we want to go to uh, tools and integrations. As you can see, there's a couple of integrations already for us, like Mail, uh, Chimp, Slack, uh, Teams, Asana, and so on. But let's go and check for Gmail through uh, Marketplace. We can go like Gmail. There's a pipe up, uh, drive for Gmail, for example, and you can visit site to install. Or we can go uh, the other way around. We want to go to automate.eo. I will leave the uh, link in the description underneath this video. And uh, you want to go to the top corner, click on integrations, and I'm sorry, and go to the bottom left part and see all categories. Now we can pick from 200 and more apps, but we are interested only in one and uh, at the moment, and that's a uh, pipe drive, but you can use obviously any other app that you need and now we have to pick the counterpart the counterpart will be will be gmail like this uh, as you can see we are already making progress so uh, yeah there are some popular integrations for us but if we uh, can't pick the one for us we can just scroll down and create our own integrations just remember Underneath the triggers, there should be pipe drive first. So let's go with the first one, for example. And underneath the actions on the right side, pick one from Gmail options. So create new label, for example. Uh, once we hit try it now, we'll get redirected. And the last thing we have to do is just to sign in to automate. And we are a few clicks away from finishing this project. Uh, we can still use Zapier or uh, Zapier.com. After we create the account here, we want to go to the top left corner and we want to make a Zap or Zap as integration. Uh, we can name our Zap, but it's not mandatory, but I recommend uh, you to do that uh, for the future research or future inspiration. Uh, we want to though, start with a trigger. It works the same way as at automate. So we are starting with pipe drive, a trigger event. You can pick from all of those options, but let's stick to the first one. Continue. Now we have to uh, connect to the account that we created. Continue. And now we can test our trigger. Underneath the second action, as you probably thought, there's a Gmail. Like this. We also have to pick an event, so stick with the first one, op of, uh, option number one. Uh, and now we have ju just to pick an account and basically our integration is done. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you on the next video.